doing your weekly read from the 18th to 24th okay of april 2020 guys what's happening now please remember this may or may not resonate okay because it's not a personalized reading okay um so it's not going to resonate with everyone right so please take and leave whatever you wish to from this reading let's see what we got for pisces sun moon rising venus and ascendant from the 18th to the 24th of april Let's see what we got. Oof, like it. Oh, Pisces, we have the Ten of Cups. Okay, so the Ten of Cups here is talking about having a harmonious family, um, having all your cups in order. Okay, happiness, harmonious playfulness happy marriage kids are happy there's a completion okay let's see what's going on i love it this could be a start of a new family as well six of cups children could have children this could be also a soulmate connection this is a reunion this is a coming together okay this is about taking that responsibility of children if you have any i think marriage itself and partnership itself is a responsibility in its own way as well so this is beautiful energy you know this is about give and take love it this is about a very um harmonious time for pisces five of wands but you're conflicted or your person's conflicted all right so someone's conflicted here all right unsure about something i'm going to clarify this towards the end somebody might be conflicted as to whether they can have this um somebody may already have this but are conflicted why somebody here wants to rebuild a family a soulmate connection somebody here wants to restart this connection all over again they want to take a chance all right Not once so somebody decided to make a move a very passionate beginning towards this connection some this person's not going to stop at anything okay this person's already they really want to come forward these guys will even pa drive past this person here it's going to even drive past a red light to get to you okay just don't break the law seriously <laughs> but no, really, this person, this person will stop at nothing to come to you. They're very passionate. And when they want something, they're going to go and get it. Let's see what's going on. Oh, okay. Six of Wands. There it is. See, I told you. Somebody's coming. Somebody's coming. They want this. Hmm. I stand by what I say. If you already have a family, there's going to be swift change, okay? And the change is going to be good. Breakthrough. Bingo. So, Pisces, you're getting a breakthrough in the situation. Mental clarity, okay? This whole chaotic, conflicted situation, you're having a breakthrough from it, okay? Things are getting clearer for you now. All right, King of Cups. This could be your energy, or you could be dealing with another Piscean, you could be dealing with a Cancer, you could be dealing with a Scorpio, okay? But I feel like this is your energy. So you've basically now got emotional control over the situation, okay? You're happy. 
you're very happy. Prince of Swords could be dealing with a younger air energy here, okay? This could be a child as well. Not necessary, but this could be somebody who is... Um, This is somebody younger. This is somebody who is guarding themselves. This is somebody who's trying to understand the situation. But this person's also trying to get a breakthrough. They could be watching the situation, how it rolls out. They could be watching you, spying on you, okay? How you do things, the way you do things. Somebody's holding back. Somebody's holding back, somebody's grounding themselves, okay? So, uh, Pisces, this could be your energy or this could be the persons that you're dealing with. Somebody here uh, may be ready to start a fight is what's coming across here with me, okay? Somebody may be ready to instigate a fight, if you know what I mean. Uh, provoke the situation. But you or this person are just holding back and you're not reciprocating. You're like, nope. Let's clarify the outcome. What is the outcome for Pisces in this reading? So you have two choices that you need to make or you have a decision, okay, um, that you need to make. And you're unsure which direction to go, okay. Um, but I think that you're going to get a breakthrough, all right. You will get a breakthrough. Situation's a little bit confusing right now i think this is about getting some balance working with cooperation with whoever this person is um let's see what's going on yeah you're thinking about what decision to take now okay regarding whatever it is that you need to do two of wands you're stuck you're stuck you're thinking about it but you're stuck okay so no decision has been made as of yet okay so let's go straight in with clarifiers angel guys please clarify the six of cups clarify the six of cups please angel guides The Empress with the Eight of Cups. Oh my God, I thought the Empress was going to be with the, the Chariot again because that's just been happening with every reading Pisces. Cross watch as you're welcome as well. The Empress and the Eight of Cups. So somebody here is busy looking after their family, their children, okay? Somebody really is um, just very busy looking after their kids and their family. Let's clarify the Five of Wands. Oh my gosh. Right. Why is the Five of Wands here, please, Angel Guides? Could be dealing with a Virgo. Got Aquarius energy here as well. Um, Scorp um, Aries, Leo, Sag. So, somebody's withdrawing themselves. Because they're really conflicted and they're trying to find answers. The more they think about it, the more conflicted they're getting, right? So, it's that saying that the more you think about something, the more you're driving yourself crazy over it. And I feel that that's what's happening, okay? So, why are you conflicted? What is this conflicted energy? You're trying to understand something. But the more you try, the more conflicted you're getting. Is it to do with this family or a soulmate connection? Is it to do with the mother or the father of the child? Let's clarify the fool because you want to start a new beginning. So let's see. Two of swords, there it is again. Yeah, choices. Okay, so you have a choice to make. You want to start a new beginning by separating yourself from someone. So this could be a soulmate connection, a person that you're with. Mother or father of the child that you're dealing with, you want to separate yourself from this person and you don't know how to go about taking that leap of faith or that chance to come out of it. Could have been a third party situation. Third party could mean um, this person was very busy in their work, had no time for the family. This third party could also mean a person, yes, 
There are so many things that can come under third party. It doesn't have to be an affair. But you know your situation better. Three of cups. <laughs> so this person could have gone to a party one day. This person could have drank too much. And next thing you know, they've had an affair. Okay. Could have been a friend. Could have been family. Um, sorry. Could have been a friend. Could have been um, anyone really. Let's clarify the Knight of Wands. have the six of swords and we have the ten of swords so you're moving forward and you're ending something you're not even thinking about it now you've come out of that conflict in my, uh, confliction okay and you're moving forward all right nothing's stopping you you're coming out of it you want to end something and you're going into a calmer situation right you're moving on You've turned it back from it, okay? You may be moving on with your family and just leaving this person behind. Let's clarify the six of wands. In fact, I'm not going to clarify the six of wands because I know what that is. Um, clearly, it just follows on from there. Let's clarify the ace of swords. What is this breakthrough that you got? Okay. Okay, so we have, was that in reverse? I think that was in reverse. In fact, I'm not going to take that back because I can't remember how I lifted that up. Temperance to the Three of Cups. So you got a breakthrough in a imbalanced situation where this person had one foot somewhere else and one foot with you, okay? So basically this person was playing around with two people or juggling two people. You got a breakthrough. You said, how now? I'm not having this anymore. So you cut this person off. Okay. Let's clarify the King of Cups. Why is the King of Cups here, please, Angel Guides? Eight of Wands came out again. So you've took swift change, swift action, or this could be communication, right? Let's see what this is. King of Pentacles, Earth Energy. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. That's you. This is your person. So basically, you've decided to now, okay, to, um, to take swift action. <clears throat> swift change. To reground yourself. To, um, to reground yourself. To have some structures to have some stability, to um, be financially stable, emotionally secure as well, all right? The other thing I'm picking from this is that you could have communicated with this person as well about this third-party situation, okay? Let's see. This person may have been very logical. You may have been very emotional. Let's see what's going on here with the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here, please, Angel Guides? I'm only going to take two, so. Page of Pentacles and Judgment. So now a decision is being made, okay? Somebody here is guarding themselves um, because somebody might be wanting to make an apology. Somebody may be wanting to make an offer, okay? Um, young Earth Energy, perhaps. Okay, this could be children as well. Somebody's making a decision here in this third-party situation. It could be because of the children as well. It could be a child that's wanting to apologise, um for things that have happened between you and this person i feel like they're watching the situation roll out if you've got kids i'm seeing that there is involvement here of kids children let's see why the four of coins is here but this child could be holding back from saying anything eight of pentacles a lot of eights here eight of pentacles so somebody is really busy holding see with the eight okay somebody here is is taking the power to have that control to hold back okay the five of cups yeah they're holding back because they know that whatever it was somebody lost something because of a third party situation they lost something good okay this was a connection that could have worked out and somebody's holding back now from working on it because they know that this connection just wasn't going to work. Okay. 
they feel the loss okay of this connection clarify the two of swords somebody here wants to come and apologize but somebody is is not willing to to accept it okay okay let's see why the two swords is here so got the nine of wands and got the devil yeah somebody's really conflicted okay somebody's really really not sure which way to go okay with this um situation they're taking a steady approach but i feel that somebody here is really guarded themselves up um they've guarded themselves up from this connection they just don't want to know anymore it's kind of like that stubbornness that stuck energy that um, i can't let anybody in i can't open up to anybody okay somebody here could really be watching the situation as well um the conflicted energy could be coming as well from the fact that they are overly thinking about the situation which is what's causing this conflicted energy we did have the two of cups at the bottom of the deck mm. let's clarify the ten of coins I think somebody's struggling, really struggling to understand what they need to do, to be fair. Chariot, somebody's thinking about taking action towards the situation. Page of Swords, there it is again. But at the same time, they're ready to fight this battle. So if somebody comes in, this person, whoever you're dealing with, comes towards you, Pisces, or vice versa. This person's ready to cut this person off. I feel as well that they could be mentally restless too, so their mouth will be working more than it should be. Okay right so at the bottom of the deck we have very stuck energy okay not knowing which direction to move because again you know somebody here has a family so it's kind of like witch drawing soul searching for a direction but not knowing which direction to go so something yeah is coming to an end let's get some advice cards for pisces see what advice the angel guides have for you guys angels guides what messages do we have for pisces what advice can we give for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for this reading, please. What advice can we give for Pisces or the person in question that Pisces is dealing with? So we have emotions are running high. Yeah, and especially with that conflicted energy here. And the more you think about the situation, the more your emotions are going to spiral out of control and you won't be able to think about what it is that you need to do. Um, when your emotions are high, we sometimes can't make the right decision let's see we have personal issues reaches resolution so once you've come out of that conflicted mind frame excuse me guys oh okay right so um once the um your emotions this confliction is all over you know you've come out of this um you know conflicted energy only then will we be able to think very clearly okay and get to a resolution with this person i feel like right now it's all about compromise um having that balance between you and this person okay and knowing the boundaries okay um in order to move forward you need to sometimes let your guard down right and i wouldn't say completely but just be resilient you know keep your guard down because that's sometimes the only way to deal with the situation. When you're too guarded, your vision, your perception can get very blocked. So let's see what's going on. We have so many celebrations, okay? So this could be with you and your kids, right? We have stress reduction. So somebody here really needs to reduce their stress. So I don't think that I really needed to say this, but it's kind of self-explanatory as well, isn't it? Pisces, you know, cross watchers who are dealing with this, that, you know, you really need to just relax, chill out. Um, you know, if, if this hasn't happened, it may happen in the future, okay? So just keep it in mind. Um, not everything would resonate um, right here, right now, okay? Um but with the lockdown going on as well, things can get really crazy. So you really need to just take some time out, you know. Okay, guys. Um, so I hope this resonated. If it did, it simply wasn't your message. 
okay please take a leave whatever you wish to from this reading and don't forget to smash that like share and subscribe um because this reading might come handy to someone that you know so don't forget to share it okay um and also um stay safe stay at home with me on youtube for meditation mindfulness and of course tarot love you guys Bye bye